Hey guys, it's Bodie with IPTVWire.com. In this quick video, I'm going to be showing you the best web browsers for any Amazon Fire Stick or Fire TV device. Now, if you've used Fire TV devices for a while now, and you go to the Amazon App Store and you search for web browsers, you're going to quickly find that your options are very limited. Like, you know, if you're using an Android device, for instance, you have tons of options with Puffin TV, Google Chrome, Brave Browser, etc. If I search web browser on the Amazon App Store, I'm going to notice some options here. The first one obviously being Silk. So Silk Browser is Amazon's pre-installed web browser on Fire TV devices. You also may notice Firefox here. Obviously, Firefox is a very popular web browser. However, the issue is when I click Firefox on my device, I get an option that says app not found. The app you are looking for could not be found. So I don't know if this is just a bug or this is something happened recently with Firefox, but it looks like you can't even use Firefox anymore on your Fire Stick or Fire TV. There's some other web browsers here, Fast Internet Search, um, some other ones you can scroll through, but guys, the quality of these browsers are not very good. So guys, really, the only two web browsers that you know work great and are optimized for Fire TV devices are the Silk Browser and the Downloader app. So if I launch the Downloader app, many may not be aware that this actually has a web browser built into it. You may be just familiar with this screen here. On the left-hand side, you'll see an option that says Browser. So if I click Browser, the Downloader app also serves as a web browser. So in this example, I'm just going to go to my website, iptvwire.com. And it should act as just a typical web browser where you can browse around my website. So I'm going to click iptvwire.com and I'm going to click go. And then just give it a few seconds while it loads up my website. And here we go, guys. So obviously this looks pretty clean in my opinion. Uh, I got my popular YouTube video there, some popular guides on my website. Um, and I'm just scrolling through just to see how this operates on Downloader. So for instance, um, if I wanna click an example here of an article, Surfshark versus IP Vanish, I wrote this one last week. And I'm just curious to see what one of my articles looks like on the browser functionality inside Downloader. So it is optimized here, the video fits the screen. Um, so it looks good in my opinion. So that's the first option guys, is the Downloader app. Now, obviously if you go back to the home screen, you know all the other functionalities of Downloader, which is side loading third party applications. I'm not gonna show that in this video because I have several other videos that show that. And I'll leave a link to those in the description below for more information. So besides the Downloader app, the other option is the Amazon Silk browser. So if you click Silk, this is probably the best option for streaming the internet on Fire TV devices. The interface now looks different with these new devices. Um, it looked different before. So here, if I wanted to access a website, for example, you'd come up and you'd click the search bar, search the web or enter URL. And again, I'm just going to click enter my website, iptvwire.com just to see what it looks like on the Silk browser and start to navigate around a little bit. So I'm gonna do iptvwire.com. Bear with me guys, I'm a little slow on the Fire Stick remote. Click go. And here I'm gonna give it a few seconds and this looks even better than the Downloader app. The Downloader app was a little scrunched up, the screen was smaller. So if I were to use anything on my Fire Stick for web browsing purposes, it would be the Amazon Silk browser. Now, unfortunately, guys, these are the only two options as of this video recording that work well and efficient for web browsing on Fire TV devices, Downloader and the Silk browser. Now, you could sideload third-party web browsers such as Puffin TV, TV Bro, the Brave browser. There's even some files out there for Google Chrome on a Fire Stick or Firefox. But guys, because these browsers are not optimized for the Fire OS or Fire TV operating system, they will not work correctly. So Downloader app and the Silk browser are your best bets for web browsers on an Amazon Fire Stick or Fire TV device. Now guys, the last thing I wanna mention for added protection if you are using these web browsers is to look at a VPN. Now Surfshark is my number one recommended VPN and you can find a special discount link below this video that will get you the best discount of up to five months free and about 80% off. So under $3 per month to get Surfshark VPN using the link below this video. Guys, that does help support myself and this channel. 
And the quick thing I wanted to point out is the clean web feature. Now I do have a dedicated video for using clean web on an Amazon Fire Stick, and I'll leave a link to that video in the description below. But that's why I would suggest using Surfshark with these web browsers on your Fire Stick is for this clean web feature that blocks ads, trackers, malware, and more. But that's it guys. Those are the best web browsers that you can use on your Amazon Fire Stick or Fire TV device. Again, this is Bodie with IPTV Wire. Appreciate you all watching this video. Subscribe to my channel, like this video. Be sure to leave a comment below. Let me know your guys' thoughts. And guys, I hope you all have a great day.